Hey everyone, Big Mike here. Uh, we are up here with um, the custodian guy. Let's talk to him because he's in danger. Brother I had suspected Augustine all along. I managed to find remnants of his journal, and it all points to Augustine's involvement with a paganistic cult operating inside the cathedral. Aye, the cathedral's dark secret has been uncovered. I too suspected this but was too afraid to act. Augustine himself is a heretic. He has covered his tracks well, claiming that the sacred relic, the hand of Jude, was stored here. He had those who came to see it murdered. The hand of Jude never existed. And with that realization, the trap closes, brother. My days here are numbered. I awoke to find this cruel dagger placed upon my pillow this morning. Oh, boy. It can only mean one thing. I know too much, and they are moving to silence me. I can only hope that what little faith I have left is enough to save my soul. Please, take this thing away from me. Um, do we want to? me to no end. May your faith protect thee, Brother Luther, for that's all you have. Yep. So, where are we supposed to go now? We have that knife. Uh-oh. They found him. Uh, are we supposed to put the sacrificial knife in the thingy? Oh, Jiminy's. <laughs> Hopefully that'll help, because I'm hearing noises again. Oh, okay. Well, I don't think there's anywhere else for us to go um, down here. Is there? What do, what do we stare? What do we... Ah! Okay. That's right. You are dead. Oh, I get it. Okay, so actually the purple thing... I, I just have it on the purple thing by default because it seems to be working, so... I'm not complaining too much about it. Owie, 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 owie. Get off, you darn thing. Oof. Okay. That was fun. Uh, you know what? Yeah, let's rearm ourselves really quickly. Um, I, I did uh, upgrade all, all of our shields to level 5, so... Or to level 2, I guess. So obviously it does take more power, but hopefully this will help us out last, will help us last a little bit longer. This would have been useful like at the very beginning of the game when I kept dying, so I don't know, although Luther doesn't have a whole lot of health either, so uh it looks like we're pretty much in the same boat. Woo, swirlies. <laughs> I like the swirlies. I wonder I'm sure the different colored twirlies have different effects, but I like the purple one because it looks like it goes with the robe or something. I don't know. Ah! So it also helps protect against my, from me, it helps, it protects me from losing my sanity, which is cool. So like I tried to mention in the last video, I'm going to be going on vacation. Uh oh, trappers. And let's just walk around them very carefully and slowly. But like I was saying, as I'm going on vacation over the over the Memorial Day break, so I'm not going to be uploading any videos at that time. Or and then I have uh, I'm starting school back up uh, like right afterwards, June first. I have a workshop that I have to go to, so I'm my productivity is going to be a lot down. So that's why I've been trying to crank out as many videos as I can right now. So that at least that way, like I mentioned, I wanted to get through at least this ch particular chapter. I think we're almost done. 
All right, our sanity is good. Still don't know what that bust is doing. Oh, let's head back over this way. Where am I going on my vacation? Well, um, it's a family trip again. We are going to San Francisco because we like it. Wow, that thing really takes away all three of our swirlies. I miss my swirlies. Alright, so there's nowhere else for us to go. I really want to know where there's that other mysterious door that we need to get into. Um, shucks. Only when thy friend is sacrificed, when his cries fill the air, will the great doors be opened to thee. Um... Okay, but... Uh, he's not in there, is he? I don't know. An ornate, long bladed knife used to sacrifice humans. For Paul to even pick it up is repulsive, for the sense of evil it emits is intense and unnerving. The souls this blade has taken live on within the metal. Uh. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so that I think our friend is dead. The monk has been sacrificed. A dagger protrudes from a deep groove within his chest. The echoes of a scream still reverberates in Paul's ears. So does that mean he was like inside the thing? I don't know. I'm sorry, dude. Um, torch. So we can actually see what's going on in here. Oh my. Guess that's still Examine, yes. Paul's progress forward is blocked by a corrosive spell. Obviously someone wants to keep intruders at bay and this lethal magic is just the way to do it. Well, so it's probably a level 2 uh, damage field. So let us cast a level 2 dispel. Boom. Thank you. So it was a good thing that we found a thing in the tabernacle. So that tells me also that it was a required item. And not just a commodity type thing in this game. Okay. Um. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is not going to be a pretty sight, guys. Look away. Ugh. Hi, dude. Lying in a pool of his own blood as a custodian, Paul's only ally in the fight against the darkness. His soul no longer lingers, fused to the altar on which his life has been taken, watching over his own rapidly cooling corpse. Feeling all hope escape in Paul's situation is suddenly a thousand times more desperate than before. Now he is alone. Alone against the darkness. Fun times. Uh-oh. You are a clever man. Wanting answers to clarify your new position as fugitive. You seek them out, and this is what you find. <laughs> Tell me, what does a man such as yourself think of when he finds a viper's nest of heresy? When he finds the very source of corruption? I think of irony. Irony of what you masquerading as a member of the Inquisition stand for, and that you stand for evil. Evil is merely a perspective which no longer concerns me, Luther. You will be executed in the most painful manner imaginable. Oh. After we have broken your frail body and mind in the name of our true Lord, Ooh, yo. Oh, that's how you pronounce it. Come, my children. Feast on this morsel. And let us return to our preparation. Um, oh boy, does that mean we have to fight somebody right now? Good doggy. Good doggy. Um, those are not good doggies. Those are very bad doggies. Um, let's see, I probably need to get the sword back out here. Ah! Owie, 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 ow
I don't think I've ever had to deal with two of these guys at once. Owies! Oh boy, what the hell? What the hell? What the hell is that? Did I die? <laughs> okay, guys, I'll meet you back here in just a little bit. I, 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 we're pretty close to the end of the chapter. I'll see you guys in just a second. Friggin' A. Okay, finally made it back here. Um, I've got my crossbow equipped. I put on a shield. Hopefully I can kill these things. I hope so. I sure hope so. That's right. Oh, I died. That's right. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Huh. Oh, okay. That went better than I expected it to be. I like having the swirlies around me too. All right, now we gotta go stop uh, the dude. I hope my swirlies aren't annoying at all. All right, so now where we go though? Oh, hey, hey, there he is. Let's stop him. Oh, he had the key for that door. Okay, let's keep going. All right, ugh, get ready to fight. It's just us and Augustine now. <gasps> Anybody? Ooh. It's dark. Anybody? I go. I don't see anybody. Aki, where'd you go, Augustine? Uh oh, what is this? This door is decorated more than most within the catacomb, sensing an immense evil, immense evil behind this door. Paul wonders if the ceremony the monk had mentioned earlier is taking place behind it. Enter and put an end to the heresy. Well, we gotta try, or at least I think this will finish the chapter for us. So. Well, here's that hallway that we saw earlier. Where's that creature, though? And where's Augustus? Sorry if you guys can hear my GameCube going. It's like, rah, 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 rah. uh oh. There it is. Does that not look like a boss from Metroid? I seriously think it, it could be. Oh, that's that's lo that's lovely. Your task, my liege and greater guardian, is to guard this place. Do not worry about this word. This guy yelps in terror at the sight of your mightiness. We will dispose of him ourselves. What? Uh -oh. Okay, well, so much for. Uh oh, do we have. Hmm, that can be kind of dissension, I suppose. Ah, poor Paul. Well, it was kind of the well, it was quick at least. So it wasn't pain, you know, as painful as Pius had wanted it to be. But now where do we go, though? We finished reading that chapter. A note from Edward, from Gra Grandpa. What do you say, Grandpa? The note reads, My dearest Alex, I am glad that you have followed my paper trail thus far. I knew I could depend on you. Is he really writing this? I have no idea or not. This will be the hard this will be the hardest part of your journey. 
Look for the 88 keys to continue your journey into the past. Your loving grandfather, Edward. The hardest part is to find the piano. Well, we know where the well 88 keys for the piano. We know the piano was back in the dining room. Um, should I save that for the next video? I'm gonna save that for the next video. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Big Mac saying later.